What's up, y'all? I'm David Brandon. And I'm Sarah Lyons. And this is Blavity News. We have some good news today. Only five days after Bank Black went viral, over 8,000 Atlanta residents have transferred their funds to Citizens Trust Bank, a Black-owned institution. That's awesome. We're out there taking action. That's yes, great. making things happen. Now, this movement was encouraged by Solange, Killer Mike, and other celebrities to urge African Americans to keep money circulating within the community. Now, this is definitely a move in the right direction. Mm -hmm. It's an example of how we can support one another, lift each other up, and plan for the future. I'm so glad that we're supporting each other because there are still too many people out there who are trying to bring us down, which yeah. brings us to our political fail of the week. This We the People petition, okay, that circulated last week, you know what I'm talking about? <laughs> I know what you're talking to about. To formally recognize Black Lives Matter as a terrorist organization. Ugh. They received about 140,000 signatures and asked for a response from the Obama administration, to which the White House said no and addressed the current climate of the country, saying, yes, this is a difficult time for our nation, it's a charged debate, but you know what, we need to stand in each other's shoes and look at the world through each other's eyes. Right. And plus, the White House plays no role in designating domestic terror organizations. No so, role. You guys are reaching out to the wrong people for the wrong reason. If you want to do this bad work, you're going to have to go through the proper channels okay, to we do don't, so. No, don't tell them what else to do. Okay, I'm not. want this to happen. Okay, I'm going to shut up. Thank you. <laughs> but I just big misunderstanding, and I think Obama said it perfectly when he said, I think it's important for us to also understand that the phrase Black Lives Matter simply refers to the notion that there's a specific vulnerability for African Americans that needs to be addressed. It doesn't suggest that other lives don't matter. Right. And though the black community expressed disappointment about President Obama's failure to address systemic racism in either of his talks, I think it was a great clap back to the all lives matter sentiment. Yes, we know all lives matter, but we're talking about black lives here, okay? That's, that's the issue right now. So that was definitely a political fail of the week, right. but we have another political fail of the week. We all have heard about this, Miss Melania Trump. <laughs> She continues to get dragged for blatantly scamming her latest speech from Michelle Obama. It's mm. been lots of fun to watch. Uh, Twitter has been having the most fun mm -hmm. using hashtag famous Melania Trump quotes. Yes. You know what, Melania, she doesn't get credit for a lot of things. Yeah. And some of our favorite tweets well, came from Jesse Bay, aka Jesse Williams. Mm -hmm. These are my favorite quotes. I am Malcolm X. Melania Trump. Yes. I know why the cage bird sings. Melania Trump. And yes. my favorite, I rock rough and stuff with my Afro puffs. Clearly, Absolutely. Melania Trump said that. Not Lady of Rage. No. Who is Lady of Rage? Guys, look up Lady of Rage. <laughs> I think that's all we have today. That's all we have. Yes, I'm David Brandon. I'm Sarah Lyons. And be sure to check out Blavity.com for more news because remember, knowledge is power. Share your power.